Hi, welcome to the MadCenter.com. Uh, hope all of you are doing well. In this uh, video, we are going to look at uh, an exam question, uh, additional maths, uh, subject code 0606 uh, slash 12. So this is paper 1. And this is the February, March 2022 uh, session, right? Okay, uh, before we look at the uh, question that we want to talk about, uh, please give this video a like and share as much as you can. Uh, please follow me on Facebook. Um, also, uh, visit themadsen.com for all your requirements in IGCSE, at maths, accounting, physics, IB, A-level maths and physics and so on. Yeah, okay, so please visit themadsen.com. Okay, um, this person, uh, question number one on this paper, uh, find the values of K such that the line y equals to 9kx plus 1 does not meet the curve, right? So the key words here, right, uh, does not meet the curve. So the solution, your solution should start like this, yeah? Basically, when you see a question like this, what should jump out at you is uh, we're going to be handling simultaneous equations and then we're going to end up with inequality. And let's see how it goes, right? Maybe uh, I'll work through some of these and then tell you what you need to get, and then uh, we'll wind up, yeah? It's easier that way, okay? So you start with simultaneous equations, right? So you write in your solution, y equals to 9kx plus 1, and y equals to kx squared plus 3x, 2k plus 1 plus 4. So label this equation 1, and label this equation 2, okay? Copy everything correctly. Great. So now, uh, what we can do is we can write this as 9kx, uh, maybe let me write this down as kx squared plus 3x, 2k plus 1 plus 4 equals 9kx plus 1. All good? Okay, we've got kx squared plus 3x, uh, 2k plus 1 plus 4, and you equate it. Now we need to set up a quadratic equation uh, in x, so we have kx squared. Plus, let's see, I've got an x here, let me stick that out, 3, 2k plus 1, and then I have a 9k x here, let me bring it to the left hand side, I'll have minus 9k, and then I have a 4 here, right, I have a 4 here, and I have a 1 here, so I'll have a 3 and I'm done. So, I have a quantity, maybe I should clean this up a little bit, k x squared plus x, let's see. I have a 6k, uh, hang on, I have 6k minus uh, 9k is minus 3k, so I can write it as 3 minus 3k plus 3 equals to 0. Let me just check that, yeah? 6k minus 9k is minus 3k, good. And then I have 3 times 1, I put. Excellent. So now I've got my quadratic equation. What happens next? Well, it does not meet the curve. So it's, what does that mean? You don't have roots. So we can write... Uh, no real roots, therefore we have b squared must be less than 4ac, right? So what is b squared? Let's do that, 3 minus 3k squared less than 4ac, okay? Now that's easy for you to do, just choose your b and your a and your c and so on. So now I have what? I have 9 minus uh, 6 times 3 is 18 uh, plus 9k squared must be less than 12k. So now I have uh, 9k squared, let's see, yeah, I have nine square, uh, 9k squared here, uh, let me quickly check this, yeah, I've got 9 and I've got uh, 2 times 3 is 6 times 3 is 18, excellent. So I bring the 12 over, I've got minus 30k plus 9 is less than 0, good, right, so divide by, let's say divide by 3, 3k squared minus 10k plus 3 less than 0. All good. So now let's go ahead and factorize this. Okay, I have 3k and I have k and I have 3 and I have 1. Looks good, yeah? So I have minus k and minus 9. Uh, k is minus 10k. Excellent. So now solving our quadratic, this is 1 over 3. Let me write this here. Right? 1 over 3 and 3. So this is 1 over 3 and this is 3. So this is less than 0. So this is what I'm looking for, right? So I can write my final answer down, k less than 3, less than 1 over 3. Okay, again, k less than 3, k bigger than 1 over 3. Okay, that's it, yeah? So this is the solution to this problem. Please uh, follow me on Facebook and uh, give this video a like and share as much as you can. 
and please visit the maxcenter.com for details of the courses in advanced online courses yeah or advanced physics a level physics maths and ib courses thank you for watching